What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. Just a quick video for you guys today. We just pulled in 2022.40.4 and you can see the change log is not too extensive. There's four new items. Uh, some have been around, some are new just to the Model S. But let's run down these really quick. As you can see, regen braking, sentry mode and dog mode, radio station logs and driver's door unlock mode are the only changes listed here on our 2021 refresh model s and for regen braking this is giving us what some of the model 3 and model y's have this is now telling us our vehicle can now automatically apply regular brakes for consistent deceleration when regen braking is limited due to battery temperature or state of charge to enable tap controls pedals and steerings apply brakes when regen braking is limited so if we go in here and go to pedals and steering you can see the new option listed right there when you actually tap on the little information dot it tells you regen braking is limited when your battery is cold or close to 100 percent charged this setting applies regular brakes on release of accelerator pedal to mimic full regen braking in those scenarios note brake pedal may feel stiffer when setting is enabled and vehicle is applying regular brakes this is due to a brake pedal oh as as you can see it went away let's go back to that really quick Brake pedal may feel stiffer when setting is enabled and vehicle is applying regular brakes. This is due to brake pedal being pressed already and this does not change the ability of vehicle to slow down. So I think that's good to have active. I'm going to go ahead and turn that on and let's move right back to our release notes. Moving on, now we have sentry and dog mode and I think this is going to be a nice little added bonus. This is now letting our vehicle and pets be kept safe by activating dog mode and sentry mode at the same time. Sentry mode alarms are silenced if dog mode and sentry mode are both enabled. Mobile app notifications will still be sent and video footage will still be saved. No additional setting is required to have this working. All you need to do is obviously be in climate and go into dog mode, lock your car, and you will be good to go. We do have radio station logs now. The media player now displays radio station logs for improved discoverability when searching our favorite stations i don't use the radio enough but i guess if you do that'll be an added bonus there as well and now driver door unlock mode when driver door unlock mode is enabled long pressing the interior driver's door switch will unlock all doors and the trunk to access driver door unlock mode tap controls lock driver door unlock mode so i don't know if this is something i'll be using specifically but let's go ahead and go into this locks and okay, here is our new mode, driver door unlock mode. On this information bubble, it says when enabled, the driver door and charge port will unlock when the key is detected near the driver's side of the vehicle. Holding down the interior driver door button will unlock the rest of the car. Um, I don't know if that's something I'm gonna use personally, but again, that is one of the newer changes. Uh, if that's something up your alley, it sounds like it's a good little safety feature to have as well if you don't want all the doors to unlock at the same time, but yeah. That is all for this one, 2022.40.1 and 40.4 were the same, just some bug fixes, but this is what we got. There is also an undocumented change, I'm not sure on which specific models, but what will happen now is there is a new icon on your cluster that will show when regen braking is either limited or being applied. It almost looks like a brake uh, caliber with a little symbol in it. That's it for this one, guys. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up this video, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace.